Hello Agastians, hope you all are fine and well at your places. This is your story time, this is your entertainment time and today I am going to narrate you a story, The Last Dinosaurs. So get ready to enjoy this story. In a lost land of tropical forest, on top of the only mountain in the region, trapped inside an old volcanic crater system, lived the last ever group of large ferocious dinosaurs. For thousands and thousands of years, they had survived all the changes on earth and now led by the great Ferocidorus. They were planning to come out of hiding and to dominate the world once again. We have spent too much time isolated from the rest of the world. Now work together, demolishing the walls of the great crater. After demolishing the walls of the great crater, finally from the top of some mountains, they saw a small town. Its houses and townsfolk seemed like tiny dots. The dinosaurs leaped down the mountainside, ready to destroy anything that stood in their way. However, as they approached that little town, the houses were getting bigger and bigger. And when the dinosaurs finally arrived, it turned out that the houses were much bigger than the dinosaurs themselves. A boy said to his father, Daddy, Daddy, I have found some tiny dinosaurs. Can I keep them? Yes, baby, you can. And such is life. The terrifying Ferocitaurus and his friends ended up as pets for the village children. Seeing how millions of years of evolution had turned their species into miniature dinosaurs, they learned that miniature lasted forever and that you must always be ready to adapt. So students, this is the story of the last dinosaurs. Hope you have enjoyed this story students. Thank you so much.